Hey YouTube, welcome back. So September, it's my birthday month. So we're kicking it off with a very quick trip to Ibiza. That's Toby Chandler's game. So it's now 10 p.m. We need to get up at quarter past four and leave. Toby's gonna take us to the airport, bless him. But yeah, I'm just finishing packing. It's gone from me, hand luggage to medium suitcase to now my extra large ofs, because you never know what's gonna happen. See you in the morning when I'm on the way to the airport. It is 4.13. Rise and shine. I'm fucking tired. I've probably slept for like four hours. Another one of my extensions came out last night, which is great. To the airport we go. Hey guys, I'm in Stansted. You wouldn't believe it. Toby drove us to the airport, bless him, 4 a.m. That's a good spot. And the M11, like, there was a huge crash and they didn't open any lanes. We were sat still for <laughs> an hour. So we were late to our flight, but Ollie's obviously got some dodgy thing in his suitcase. So he's just getting, oh look, I love how they don't zip up your case when they check it. But yeah, we're just getting his case and I'm going straight to the bar. We're gonna make it. I like dumped my case. It looked like it was going to Ibiza, so fingers crossed, but yeah. I know it says go to gate, but I must. I must now drink some alcohol to just take the edge off my morning. <laughs> By the way, drink responsibly, obviously, but I'm gonna down it. Cheers! <laughs> we fucking made it! <laughs> I don't know if you guys have met, that's Sophie and that's Ollie. Probably out, not sure. Maybe that's happy to be here, look. Whoa! Yeah. Guys, I'm dying. We have a whole bar. Bar airport drinker! Last <laughs> wankers. Okay guys, we are here. I've actually got changed, but this is the outside. We've got a little pool, a little sunbathing area. We've got a fucking huge lizard. Obviously he's coming out tonight. But how cute is this? I'm so glad it's windy. It's so hot. Got a little table for me eat. Oh, and another table for my Oh my god! There was a lizard. Did anyone just see that lizard? This is the inside. There's Ollie, the manager of the trip. The living area, little kitchen. So cute. This is Sophie and Ollie's bedroom in here. Here you go. <laughs> there's a bedroom there, and then there's a toilet there, and then upstairs. This is my room, but it's mine, Nicole, Millie, and Lucinda's room. There's like a walk in wardrobe. This is my little pink outfit of the day. And this is the bathroom. Literally just got in, got ready. I've just put on a tiny bit of foundation, like the um, flawless filter. But we're gonna go to Nikki Beach, so I'll take you with us. Okay, we're in the taxi on the way and they just crashed. So we're just kind of, just oh, kind of waiting to see, oh my God, they're coming. Literally. Literally. She's like, hello. I'm at Nikki Beach. <laughs> <laughs> this is so cool, we've and got an opium bed. Beach. It's going to zero, and you get this bed and you have to do a minimum spend. So it's not price for the table and then spend, it's like fucking UK. So I just had a tequila shot, I don't even like tequila. No, I, my, my first runway. Hello losers in England. Hello. This one's for you. <laughs> Sushina, champagne, hey. with the mama. Hi, I'm tired. Everyone else is trying. Wow. It's so easy to walk in. Who wants to get a flight and fucking wet over time? Get your double chill out. This is what's going on right now. But also consider they're made for girls that are meant to be walking around and dancing. He's got frozen strawberry duck. Get your duck it. Me and Drew just passed out. She was, we were talking, we lay down, we just went. I knew not to lay down and then within 30 seconds of laying on my back, I was out. I felt like I was in class and it was a boring ass lecture. I'm not joking. And then I had Sophie go, guys, the bill's here. I was like, oh. Fuck, I'm falling asleep. Okay, I'm vlogging my phone again. This is my outfit, my little glittering ball. I am so old, like I'm tired. I just want to lay down and watch TikTok, but here we go again. Going to Amber Dub. They're raving and raring. I need an espresso martini. That's what I need, so hopefully they sell them. But yeah, all 10 million. Vibes at Balfordham. Hello, darling. We've got a huge table because everyone else is stuck on an aeroplane. These ladies. It's so cool in here. And the menu is like right on my street. There's sushi, Thai. I'm going to get gyoza, spring rolls, pad thai, bao buns, dumplings, dim sum. You fucking name it. I'm going to have it, boy. Morning. Guess who was really cold last night? Me. So I slept in a hoodie. But we're up, Nicole's there. Is there no furniture? 
What do you mean? Oh, yeah. Well, there's one turn there. Billy and Lisa not on their way, but I thought I'd show you just what everyone's getting up to in the villa. Hugh Hef and his bunnies. <laughs> Did someone order Nicki Minaj? <laughs> We're literally just chilling. I'm gonna chill for another 10 minutes and then get ready because the ocean's a big day. Good morning. We're up. Good morning. And we've just been to the supermarket and we're all here. And we didn't realize it's a 20 minute walk and we have about 100 bottles of water, which is just fucking perfect. Sophie and Ollie actually ditched us. I don't know where they are to help with the heavy load. But yeah, we're just checking through rural Ibiza. Look who's turned up. And then, uh, like, got this one as well. Like, they were like, be flowing. We're up the ocean. Blood, part one. Just gone for a wait. I actually went for a poo. Here's the party. Hey guys, it's like five o'clock, might even be six o'clock next day. Here's the guy, there's <laughs> Daisy. I've been feeling great. Yeah, I feel really good. And look what's oh, fucking sweet. came in the house. Go on, my friend, look. Don't Hi guys, I have been so shit vlogging, but this is really good today. It was something else. But we are here, we're at Mint, which is next to Mambo's, and so Mint is I'm trying to yeah. get the fucking golden hour picture. I've lost my voice because of the aircon, obviously. Before you all say I've got another accent. Uh, <laughs> that's what's going on. I was too hungover to even look at my camera. Here's everyone. Just enjoying their time. So my dinner just come. We've got a seafood linguine. Oh my god, my nail. Hello. Obviously, I'm getting another drink. What drink have you got? What do you take this for? Holly so. has got awards for holiday. Holly, you have to shout. So, our first award, our very first award, goes to our local thief, Emily. <laughs> <laughs> she loves to snoop through bags, and I think that deserves our first award. So, Emily. <laughs> Our second award of the evening goes to the Cradle Snatcher. Our third award, which is also potentially the most iconic of the evening, the person who likes to wear the least clothes and stands for strangers and men and women alike against the pool, is Miss Daisy. I'm gonna go get a taxi and go home, but I've ended up at the strip. I feel like a 12 year old. You will make my soul. I feel like I'm living my best days in your life. All I sound like Wayne in the club. Oh, we're on this strip. Oh my god, hold your camera. Oh my god, that's Hello, Wayne. By the way, we're all exposing each other's DMs of ATM celebrity. ATM Drake in 2018 saying, hey. Daisy DM Ruben loved his cheek saying, I heard it's coming home, do you want to come in my home? No, that's not so That's what I I've not actually picked up a vlogging device in two days. Can you hear how bad my voice is? This is the roughest I've been after holiday. So obviously, we went to dinner, had our awards, and then we went to the club, and then we just went back to the villa and just were like playing in the pool, like whatever, you know. And then we all went to bed at a reasonable time, like maybe half past one, we went to bed. 
and I just like fell straight to sleep, whatever. I've woken up at 8 a.m. and I am violently sick, like like projectile. I guess it's got mileage in it, right? And then I can hear someone downstairs being sick. I'm thinking, what the fuck? Go downstairs, Sophie's throwing up. And hearing I did made me throw up again. Then I walk away and then Drew's throwing up. Then Poppy throws up and then literally everyone is so ill. So I don't know whether it was like food poisoning, which is doing too much, whatever. I felt like I've spent most of that holiday just feeling like shit. So I was too tired. Then I was starting to stroke. Then I was hanging out my arsehole. And then I've obviously got like food poisoning. But yeah, so that had that I had to go to the airport. Spent like an hour in the IB for airport toilets and on the plane home, I spent like 20 minutes in the toilet just shitting my brains out because obviously I was fucking ill. Got back home and just like laid in my bed thinking that I can never go back to Ibiza. Oh, Jack, I'll go next year. Oh, my throat. But yeah, Ibiza, you were really fun. Um, I can't act you anymore. Like, I'm too fucking old. It was good, like, early birthday celebrations, but I'm really not in a rush to go back. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry that most of the vlog was on my phone, but I just get too scared about taking my camera out when I've had a drink. And also, my bags are quite small. They don't really fit in there. But I just don't want to lose this camera because they're fucking expensive. So yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog i certainly enjoyed myself at times look how many lashes i've got left like seriously can you be asked i still feel really rough as well which is just fucking great i just need my voice to come back and that's it don't forget to like comment subscribe and i will see you all soon i feel like now i've got this holiday out of the way i got some really exciting bits coming up which I can't fucking tell you about. I'm actually going somewhere for an amount of time that I can't disclose and none of you will know because I'm gonna hide it on social media, but I'm up to something. Just know something's coming, okay? Love you, bye.